So how do they truly feel about you right now? We have the Five of Cups and the Queen of Cups. We have Faithfulness. That's loads of cards. Betrayed, hurt, and you make me feel so happy. So, I feel as though there's been some sort of turnaround here. Maybe this person felt like you are leaving them. Five of Cups, it's about loss or the belief in loss. It always shows two cups standing upright, though. Um, they are certain of your love for them, okay? They feel happy now after a time of feeling like maybe you betrayed them or they felt very hurt. I feel like in many cases this was a misunderstanding because we have faithfulness here. You love this person completely. Um, you may have opened your heart to this person, Queen of Cups. You may have offered this person reassurance or that this may be what they are needing. And then they're turning into this immense happiness. There's a shift into immense happiness. We have the King of Wands. Lots of passion from this person. Yeah, look, two of cups in reverse. Um, yeah, they, they feared loss, but they're happy now because there's this immense knowing that you love them completely. Hope. Yeah, it's like they couldn't see clearly. There was this mask over their eyes. But now their eyes are peeking out from below. This hope is returning. I feel like your person was thinking worst case scenarios. That your connection was falling apart or something. They were fearing loss. This was immense like heartbreak to your person. Um, immense fears, pain. Service. And misfortune. So yeah, they feared tower moments. Immense pain because of this. I do feel for many of you it's a misunderstanding. It will be different for different people though. Service. This is um, moving back into powerfully... Working together in this connection. You're both very giving, very faithful, very loving. Inspired. And they're just feeling happiness, okay? They're feeling relief. Rock bottom. Yeah, your person feared that this was rock bottom. That there was like an ending. Because these look like death. They feared there was some sort of ending between you both. This person, they may have immense fears of abandonment, loss, betrayal, heartbreak. How else are they feeling? I feel nervous around you. I feel, again, this was nervousness that there was... Your connection was falling apart. They were in their man or woman cave. But this is them coming out of this again. Them placing these boulders to one side. So that they can come out, open their heart. I think about you constantly. Yeah. There's a sense of happiness returning. In this connection, thinking really positive thoughts. This is true love. So this triggering is overall helping this person to realise that this is true love. 
is getting this person to focus on their intuition rather than the fears in their mind of loss. This is true love. You love this person completely. This is either what they really need to know or you've already offered them that truth, that reassurance as this Queen of Cups. You've offered them your heart. Everything's fallen apart. Again, this was what they were fearing with this misfortune, like the Tower card. But it was an illusion. We started off with the Five of Cups, the illusion of loss. It's worth it. So I feel like you're both on this journey of opening your hearts, being vulnerable, learning how to have faith, learning how to trust your own intuition because the intuition within you both is so powerful Not when it comes to knowing that this is true love, knowing that you love each other equally. It's worth it, you know. They feel it's worth it doing this healing work. I mean, this is one of the main reasons why you met, for immense healing and awakening. And it is scary. It is challenging. It's it's going to be, you know, it's meant to be. This is the real me. So this is shifting um, into a deepening of the intimacy, the deepening of the vulnerability between you both this is the real me this is the journey that you are on together helping each other to come out of your shells come out from thick walls or masks that you felt pressured to wear um, in this world this is a true authentic love because you both desire true intimacy to feel safe secure comfortable being your true selves and this is what's happening overall. I'm in a dark place. So again, they were in some sort of rock bottom. They feared some sort of betrayal or loss or immense heartbreak. They were feeling very hurt. This is your person thinking worst case scenarios to do with everything's falling apart. And But now they are knowing or there's a shift occurring where they are knowing that you are meant to be. This is we are meant to be. And we have I'm embracing my power. This is them embracing their intuition, embracing that self-esteem, knowing that they are lovable. Because I feel a lot of these um, fears of worst case scenarios are to do with this person perhaps struggling somewhat to love themselves or to know their worth because of previous wounds they've experienced throughout their life. Let's dive deeper. We have the King of Pentacles. This is your person feeling more secure and stable within themselves because of some sort of reassurance coming in. I feel like it needs to be from you. Successful, confident, fulfilled, stable, wise, proud. This is your person coming into a lot of a lot more of that self-esteem, inner stability, and really embodying this, really grounding this within themselves. This is a prickly pair. So th these this prickly pair is making me think of they sometimes have these really sharp and cutting thoughts and feel it creates painful emotions to again to do a thinking worst case scenarios but this is more stability coming in a, a joyfulness with that sunny yellow energy and we had the sun you make me feel so happy we have the four of cups this is like you offering your heart to this person, but then not being able to see it. When they're thinking worst case scenarios, um, you could be loving this person completely and giving them your heart like that Queen of Cups, but they can't see it sometimes. They can't hear beyond like the noise of that fearful mind. Um, 
so that they may have feared that you were getting bored or something because four of cups is about boredom it says dissatisfied um autonomous unfulfilled frustrated yeah but overall i feel this is like you giving this person your heart but they're not being able to receive it or see it or know your love at times because they're in a dark place i can't see clearly in the dark but this is the ten of pentacles secure blessed tenderness love successful happy proud this is this security of your connection the security of your love of your bond um them being this really powerful provider for you in this connection and them really understanding this them really understanding their worth their worth you know in in your eyes how you um really love them how you really appreciate them and we have the knight of swords it says certain energized dominant this is like that personal empowerment coming back fast action motivated ambitious um this is clarity coming into this person very fast and i'm placing this over we are meant to be so if this reading has resonated with you please let me know in the comments give it a thumbs up share it subscribe that all really helps me out with the algorithm thank you so much for joining me here take care bye